Hi everybody, it's me with another Mindful 10. And today I really want to ask you, when have you last contacted your inner child? You know, the one, the one inside of you who likes the fun and the play, who likes to explore and is curious. So when did you last have contact with him or her? When was the last time you had a real, real belly laugh? When was the last time you did something really, really silly and felt so good about it? Do you remember those moments? Do you remember them? I do. <laughs> I remember really jumping into puddles and having heaps of fun. Mind you, that wasn't in Germany, to be honest. But when was the last time you had a really massive belly laugh? Yesterday? Great. Wonderful. Congratulations. You can't remember? Hmm. All good. All good. So let's face it. Let's really face it. There is sadness in us. There's probably in a lot of us, a lot of sadness. That's totally okay. And that needs to be lived. But there's also fun and laughter in us. There's also this, this being in us that just wants to have fun. And it's not just girls who just want to have fun. So there's this being in us that really wants to explore, that is curious, that wants to change, that wants something new. Can you feel it? Can you feel that being inside of you that wants to have that massive belly laugh? that wants to do something totally silly without harming anybody else, of course. That wants to just, you know, explore. Just, just take the bike and go somewhere and find something new, something different. Just break out of those, those, those patterns, break out of those <sighs> every day the same. And you can do that. I mean, you don't have to sell everything and go off to Bali to do that. You can just, I mean, you can just jump into your car, jump onto your bike, or just walk into a place where you've never been before, a cafe you've never been before. Go into the water, have a swim, if you haven't done that for a long time. Do something that is different. Do something that is new to you. Do something where you think, oh, I really want to do that, but I can't because of blah, 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 blah. You can. You can. You can. But you need to do it. So the more you live this funny side of you, this silly side of you, this, this craziness, the way you want it, the more fulfilled you will be. Your inner child is just waiting for that. Because he or she wants that. So sometimes we need to go inside of us and tap into that feeling or into that inner child or just into that feeling of crazy silliness and find a way to live it. Find a way to live it. So maybe find um, a picture of yours as a child that you really like. Find this picture and have a look at it find this picture of yourself as a child grab it and look at it how does that make you feel so this is your homework for this for today's mindfulness um, um, meditation or contemplation or whatever you want to call it find a picture of you as a child and look at it what does he or she feel? What does he or she want? And are you living it for him or her? If not, why not? If yes, beautiful, amazing, love it, great. So tap into that inner child of yours, the one that is about fun. 
you will probably also find a side of your inner child that's a bit sadness and that's okay because this is you then maybe you start realizing why sometimes you seem to be sad with no reason it's your inner child calling you go first to the side where the fun is Go first to the side where you want to explore the new, the change. Because, for instance, if you're feeling stuck, you don't know how to get out of it. Yes, it's okay. Tap into that energy. Tap into that side of yourself that wants to have fun, that wants to explore the new, that wants and embraces the difference, making a difference. And maybe that experience of remembering the child that you were, remembering what you really wanted as a child, what was the most fun. If you practice that just, just, just for an hour a week, that is something that can shift you out of that stuckness. That is something that can actually shift you out of your stuckness. Doing something different, doing something from the heart, something that you always wanted to do, having that fun, like the budgies over there, they're having fun. They don't care about inner child or anything, they just chip whenever they want. Sing your song. Use your throat chakra to sing your song, use your tones, use your words, use your wishes, your thoughts, everything and live what your inner child probably couldn't back then. Do it for him or her. Look at the picture. Do it for him or her. It will fulfill a dream that he or she had as a little child. This is your homework. Find that picture. Look at it. Feel into it. And feel what he or she wanted, still wants, still looking for. And he or she will help you getting out of that stuck place. He or she will help you having fun exploring something new and different. Enjoy this experience. Enjoy it. It is fun. It is big fun. Dive into it. And if you should find something when you're not sure what to think of it, how to cope with it, you know where to find me. I'm here. Have a great day. And enjoy your inner child. Have fun.